Hi there, I'll give you a quick tour of apartment 1119 in the carriage house. It's a nice unit. It's a big unit, beautiful views. And I'll take you right over the view. It's got an expansive ocean view from, uh, from most of the rooms. And uh, this is what you'll be enjoying each day from your living area. And uh, this particular unit juts out from the rest of the building offering you these these gorgeous views so you can see it from your dining area your living area um, see someone out there rowing a uh, boat probably can't pick that up in the camera so I'll just swing around to the kitchen it's a nice kitchen very good condition and it's got everything That's just another uh, exit there. I don't think anybody uses that door just leading out to the hallway. And this apartment is sold uh, furnished. So I'll give you a view from this uh, angle. And to our left is, uh, is a bedroom one of the uh, three or four bedrooms and then I think it has uh, three bathrooms so a little bit of space over here and you can see the ocean from this room so that that could be a den or regular bedroom uh, let me take you out to the patio. It's a nice big size patio with a dinette set. And uh, it has glass doors even on this side, which is great for the winter months because a lot of times when you come down in January, that, that wind is just a little too cold to be out here. So that renders a lot of the patios around here obsolete but you can still enjoy your patio even in the winter months uh, there's a little basketball court there someone said it has another type of sport I forget what they said uh, racquetball or something and then the gym is in that building down below just behind the basketball court so uh, this room uh, uh, is adjacent to the living uh, the second bedroom and that's your master on that uh, side. I see we even have a, um, what do you call those uh, couches that fold out? I'll think of it in a minute. Anyway, uh, we're back in the foyer and let's hit the second bedroom. I'm not quite ready for prime time, but at least you'll get an idea of the layout. And that's a real pristine view there. That's a real stellar view from even the second bedroom. Let me just shoot it from this angle so you can get the perspective. Big wall closet there. It's a good sized bedroom. It's, it's, it's bigger than most. And let's hit the main bathroom while we're here. So we've got a shower and dual sinks. So uh, more than one, uh, one of the kids can use that. We'll just go ahead and hit the utility room while we're standing here. It's a good size. You can put lots of storage in here. Put all your uh, beach paraphernalia in here, your beach ball, and your, your beach chairs, etc. Um, okay, we're in the master, and uh, you got a nice, I see a big ship in the distance, you probably can't pick it up, but if those blinds were open, you'd have a nice view of the ocean, so let me see if we can... Give you a shot at the 
bedroom. Big, uh, lots of, uh, whoops, lots of space. Um, so this this could handle any uh, any full size king bedroom set. I think this bed right here is a king. So it's got a huge walk in. So I see the phone is adding some background music, but th this is an enormous walk in. We, we won't dare call this the fourth bedroom, but uh, it's got lots of closet organizers. And then uh, we've got another bathroom over here. And then you have uh, what I might call a, a bonus room that you could use for uh, m multiple purposes. Um, let's see if I can find the light switch. Uh-oh. Anyway, uh, let me hit the lights. This has a separate entrance, um, and you could put a, a housekeeper in here, uh, and some overflow of guests, and uh, I guess they're using it as a day uh, bedroom, den, or computer room. Anyway, there is a third bathroom here, just a little bathroom for your mother-in-law or your housekeeper. And it does have a, a shower. And everything is clean and in good condition in the apartment. So uh, let me leave you with the view. We'll go back in the, the living room. I can make my way over there quickly. So you'll get another shot of the layout. While I'm heading back to the uh, the main reason you're you're here, which is this uh, this fabulous ocean front, so uh, give us a call. We'll be looking forward to showing it to you, or or call your realtor, and we'll get you in right away uh, to see it. Thanks a lot. Here's a shot of the uh, pool area. They've got private cabanas. Uh, A lot of natives out here soaking up sun and enjoying the pool. And uh, I'll walk over to the gym area, which is I think that glass enclosure area in the uh, in the background there, that corner on the second deck. I'll see if I can make my way over there. Don't know if I can get in, but let's see if we can show you as much as we can of it. Well, I, I'm out here looking at the reason that you're coming out to live here. Uh, beautiful day. It's it's approaching dusk on this uh, this Sunday evening, and uh, this is the gym. Don't know that I'm going to get into it. I don't think so. But let's see how good this works. Uh, well, it looks I'm looking in the viewer. It looks like you can make some of the machines out. It's big. It's a big gym. Uh, let me just go up to the other window and do the same thing. So uh, it's picking up a little more than I thought it would. So uh, not having a, uh, the uh, key. So let me just go to the next window and do the same thing. So looks like we've got uh, treadmills and medicine balls and free weights and uh, weight machines, bench presses, and, and the like. So it is a, it's a big gym. I, I've, I've seen a lot smaller than that. And of course you have the uh, ocean there to motivate and give you a tranquil uh, exercise session. So between the tennis and the basketball and the gym and the pool, I, I think you're gonna be doing great out here. So, uh, Anyway, I'll leave you with a shot of the uh, the waves and the uh, and the white foam. So uh, come on down and uh, enjoy it. Look forward to hearing from you.
on the uh, first level. Apparently there's a little restaurant here and um, Del Mar restaurant. Uh, some offices, convenience store. We're back over to the balcony, I mean the uh, lobby area. And this is the uh, front entrance of the building. Uh, I believe across the street there's some tennis courts. I don't know if you can make that out, but they're across the across the way there. I think there I think there's two, and uh, it's beautiful across. You probably can't make it out, but it's beautiful, lovely green grass. So we're in the balcony area. There's a concierge and valet parking, and uh, we'll make our way over to the uh, pool area if we can. I'm out here at the entrance of uh, the carriage house and uh, it's uh, around sunset or dusk uh, time approaching and it's got the most beautiful little park setting across the street with uh, beautiful green grass and park benches that you can sit and uh, meditate there. Uh, I mentioned before the tennis courts are across the street. I think you enter through that building facade there uh, to the tennis courts and uh, these are some spectacular homes here on the intracoastal those would be on pine tree drive beautiful uh, mansions there and uh, this is the entrance to the building with the valet parking and uh, I'll just give you a little walk down the front of the uh, the building so uh, we're obviously on 54th Street and uh, on Collins Avenue. So it's a well-kept, well-run uh, building. I was just uh, speaking with one of the uh, officers and he was uh, reiterating how well run it is and uh, everything's in good shape here. So. Uh, Okay, again, uh, come on down, and uh, and we'll give you give you a tour, and uh, you can make this your home.